How's it going guys, Colgan here. I'm going to show you how you can instantly upgrade every tower, spell and common in Ironheart Steam Tower. It's very simple to do, all you have to do is edit one line of text in a document file in the game's folder. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up my computer. You're going to open local disk C. You're going to open a folder called users. Now in here you should find a folder named after the username of your computer. You're going to open up this folder. You're going to open app data, roaming. Now in here, you should find a folder called 8floor. 8floor are the developer of the game. So we're going to open the folder 8floor. Now in here, you should find a list of games developed by 8floor that you currently have installed on your computer. In this case, it's going to be Ironheart. So we're going to open the folder Ironheart. Now in here, you should see an XML document file called profiles. You're going to right click on this file and you're going to open with your notepad. You're going to maximize the notepad file. Now don't worry if you don't understand anything in this text file. It's very simple. All we're going to have to do is scroll to the very bottom of this file and you're going to find a line of text that says gems amount equals followed by a number. The number in this line of text represents how many gems are in Ironheart's case cogs that you currently have on your save file. So we're going to change whatever number is here into whatever number you want. In my case, I'm going to write down 10,000 gems because 10,000 is more than enough to fully upgrade everything in the game. So now that I have 10,000 put in, I'm going to click file and I'm going to click save. So now when I boot up the game, I'm going to have 10,000 cogs to spend on my upgrades. So now that I'm in game, I'm going to click on the shop. And as you can see, I now have 10,000 cogs to spend on my upgrades. So now I can instantly upgrade everything there is to upgrade without having to replay through the levels hundreds of times to get the amount of cogs required. I hope this video helped you and thanks for watching.